We had a group of wonderful young women come into the studio to talk to some of our industry professionals about what it's like to work in the gaming industry and in tech in general. Um, and I think it's a really important um, cause for us to support. Uh, not too many women get encouraged to go into tech, so providing them an opportunity to see themselves in these roles I think is really, really important. The women here are very uh, well accepted and included. Everyone's really respectful and they treat us as equal members of our teams. I definitely feel like my skill and my talent is well respected. The best way that I can describe it is it's like anywhere else that you would go if it wasn't tech or it wasn't gaming. Everyone is welcome with open arms. You come into the office and everyone's passionate and hardworking uh, about games. No one's ever looked at me differently. It's always been a really close-knit kind of community. I've loved gaming ever since I was a kid. It's been a huge passion of mine. My whole family is in games. My sister's a programmer and she's married to a game designer. And my brother is in QA. My first console was um, an Atari. So I've been gaming for mostly my entire life. I looked at the games industry and I saw all the cool art that they were making for my favorite games and I thought, hey, I can do that. I didn't think I was going to get into the gaming industry because I studied graphic design. But I persevered, I applied, and I, I just really wanted to work doing something that I love. Success doesn't lay solely on your education. What matters is that you work hard, you live and breathe it, and you never stop creating. Maintain your self-confidence and have that ambition to keep reaching higher. Play a game, experiment with science, sign up for a course. Uh, I think that there could be a lot of people that stand in your way, but use that as an opportunity to prove them wrong. I don't think anything should like limit you in the options you want and the dream job you want. You have to break those stereotypes. You have to get involved. You have to follow your dreams. I couldn't imagine our game being as successful without women on our team, for sure.